Hello Xer Solutionist. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about the basic thread. This is the sample output. Observe the thread start and the output. This is the interface of 4, it has a label and button. We created a class. It has an MA space thread lab. The name of the class is my thread class. Then we have created a static void named thread1 method. Inside of it is the for loop condition. For loop with the condition of loop count start with zero, and if loop count is less than equals to five, then increment it. Inside of the loop, we initialize the thread as the thread that is equal to the current thread. Then we print the name of the thread with the loop. Then thread sleep with 1.5 seconds. So the use of this method is to loop the current name of the method five times while sleeping with 1.5 seconds. Now we will insert the code to our form class. This is the form class it is a thread lab name space. The name of the class form is from basic thread as form. We initialize the thread as thread a and thread b. Inside of the class form, we initialize button one event click. Inside of the event, we declared label var name label one text is equal to thread start. We printed also that the thread starts. We initialize thread start named as del thread one is equals to a new thread start my thread class in the thread one method. So the thread start will start the class method function which will loop the current name of the thread when the thread is started. We declared thread a and thread b is equals to a new thread with the parameter of del thread one. Then we add a name for thread a and thread b. Then we start the threads and join all the threads to start. Then after the thread finishes running then the labeled text will be equals to end of the thread. Then we print also that end of the thread. So this is the sample output. Observe that every loop is sleeping by 1.5 seconds and the label is changing a text. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel.